So a lot of employers and teachers that use iOS in their workplaces or schools rely on a little feature called guided access for those times when they need to lock their employees or students in a particular app. And I want to make this video to say that it's not a foolproof solution because any employee or student, and anybody for that matter, can easily break out of it. And I'm going to show you this fatal flaw in this video. Spoiler alert, it's pretty easy and simple to exploit. All right, so now I'm back in the studio on my iPad so I can show you what exactly this fatal flaw is. So now let's say I'm an employer who wants to lock an employee in Google Sheets. Say he's getting distracted when he's supposed to be making a schedule. So I, as the employer, go ahead and triple click the home button and enable a guided access. I'm basically gonna prevent him from locking the system, even changing the volume, like eliminate any distractions, like motion, keyboard, and such, like only the bare essentials. And I'm gonna disable that back button and all this extra stuff right here, just to make sure he's actually doing his job. Okay, then I'm gonna go ahead and start it. Set a passcode. All right, and I cannot do a screen capture for this part because first of all, iOS won't even let you screen capture and guided access. And second, this exploit involves actually forcing a shutdown. So that would cancel the screen recording anyway. But anyway, I'm gonna take my iPad right here, show it as best I can. I'm basically gonna press the home button and the sleep wake button at the same time, hold it there, and it'll go black. That means it's forced off. So now this will take a little while. So I'll skip right to this being rebooted. And then once the iPad's rebooted and I'm past the lock screen, I can go into any app I want. I can go to youtube.com, watch some videos from my favorite channel, waste my time there when I really should be making a schedule. And there you go, it's that easy. And really all you have to know to do this is how to force shut down the device. Now, employer might be confused and then just re-enable guided access, but you as the employer could just keep doing this as many times as you like. And then I could go into settings, accessibility, guided access, passcode settings, and then just change the passcode to whatever I want. Now, of course, don't actually do that in a real workplace. You'll probably get fired. I'm just making this video to inform employers and teachers that guided access is not perfect. There is a fatal flaw in there that is easy to exploit. And all you have to know how to do is force shut down the device. And I just want you to be aware of that. So thanks for watching. If you liked this video, found it informative, hit the like button, share this video with your friends, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment.